accident uh, management plan uh, talk, has these uh, procedures. So um, the management plan also includes how to deal with situations where the containment vessel can be damaged um, and uh, the pressure in the wet well and the dry well situation. So there are procedures in place uh, to follow if a more severe situation occurs at the power plant. Now the helicopter water drop um, operation, what was the effect? I think that was the question that, that we have received. Um, in order to cool the spent uh, fuel storage pool, we have uh, carried out, we have asked uh, the SF to carry out the water drop operation and also uh, the spraying of water from the ground. Uh, this needs to continue in several waves. Therefore, uh, we will continue to ask uh, for the cooperation of involved people so that we can carry this out continuously. And the helicopter water dumping operation is something that we have asked the government to provide us help with and also with the spraying of water, uh, what is the changes in the level of radiation as of March 17th, uh, today at 9.30? Oh, it's 3,786 microsieverts per hour. Um, an, an hour later at 10.30, it went down to 3,750, um, a bit lower than previously. And at the pre at reactor number one at Daiichi plant and all the way up to reactor number three, the amount of water that has been injected, um, that was another question raised. The flow and also the total amount of water, I'm very sorry, we haven't, we don't have accurate information, but for reactor number one, Right, that was a live press conference held by the Tokyo Electric Power Company. About uh, OK, back to the report there for NHK. Uh, very scant details, really, I think it has to be said about uh, what is going on. They're talking about uh, firing the water cannons on, which had to be temporarily suspended uh, a short time ago because radiation levels rose again. Uh, the helicopters from the air, uh, Tokyo Electric Power talking about there and also talking about the walls around the whole of the site. The uh, perimeter fence has, has collapsed. Uh, but we'll wait for the details of what is being done and how that uh, cooling process is going. Uh, we're going to take a look at the situation in Libya very briefly. A few things happening there this afternoon.